TLC added Seeking Sister Wife to its roster of programs in January 2018, since when viewers have come to love or loathe famous polygamous couples such as the Joneses, the McGees, and the Snowdens. As the title implies, these couples are actively seeking to add new sister wives to their family unit, which, at first glance, appears simpler than it really is. Garrick and Danielle Merrifield, who we'll be focusing on, have been one of the show's most controversial couples and have somewhat become the villains of the series. We'll be answering the burning question that everyone's been asking, are the couple still together? What happened with Roberta? Did Garrick and Danielle work through their jealousy and trust issues? Garrick and Danielle Merrifield hail from Colorado and share two sons named Solomon and Jeremiah. The couple joined Seeking Sister Wife in its third season and became polygamous after being in a happily monogamous relationship for over a decade. Unsurprisingly, Garrick was the one who suggested the change. Well, there is almost no such thing as brother husbands. Both adults appeared happy at first to practice polygamy, albeit for different reasons. As Garrick said in the season 4 premiere, he and Danielle felt that God had led them towards polygamy, whereas Danielle is interested in having a big family with plenty of love and babies to go around. Although their outlook on polygamy appeared positive, the Merrifields' experience with Roberta was anything but. Garrick and Danielle met Roberta on an online dating site during the filming of season 3. The glamorous Brazilian native and the Colorado couple got on like a house on fire, so much so that the Merrifields put their children and jobs on the back burner and traveled to Brazil on several occasions during the courtship phase. Trouble arose when Roberta accepted Garrick's proposal, as she could only enter the U.S. with a K-1 visa, which viewers of 90 Day Fiancé will be familiar with. A K-1 visa is necessary for the fiancés of American citizens to enter the country, but only if the couple became legally married within three months. If not, then the foreign fiancé is forced to return to their home country permanently. However, Garrick and Danielle had already been legally married for years. After much persuasion, Danielle reluctantly divorced Garrick, actually rescinding all her legal rights as a spouse, so that Roberta could obtain her visa and legally marry Garrick. Although Garrick and Danielle remained spiritually married, she found it hard to get used to the sudden shift in the dynamics of their relationship and began having regrets about the decision she'd taken, so much so that many were waiting for the couple to split up. Despite the rumors, Garrick and Danielle are still together. In fact, her Instagram handle is at wifey underscore Merrifield, and her bio on the social media platform proudly describes her as a wing woman to her husband and mother of two amazing boys. The couple saw in the new year together with a celebratory video in which they shared a romantic kiss and toasted with champagne, but Roberta was nowhere to be seen. As it happens, Roberta pretty much ghosted the naive Merrifields after getting her K-1 visa. In season four, the Brazilian native's mother began having health issues, and Roberta stayed in her home country to take care of her. After over a year passed without seeing their sister wife, Garrick and Danielle decided to look for another one, although they apparently still had no intentions of replacing Roberta. However, Roberta was anything but pleased to hear that the third wife would be joining the family, especially before she'd had a chance to settle into her new life with the couple. It appears that Roberta wanted to get used to the U.S. and living with the Merrifields first, and when Garrick revealed that he was courting a new woman and had even gone on dates with her, she was furious. The situation took a turn for the worse when the Merrifields returned to Colorado and received a text message from Roberta, which was addressed to Danielle. Roberta spoke of feeling excluded and strangely cited cultural differences as the reason for her negative attitude towards a third sister wife. It's also possible that she felt that Garrick and Danielle were replacing her, but whatever the case, she abruptly ceased all communication with the Merrifields. Ironically, it had been Danielle's idea to introduce a third wife to the family so that there would be more balance. When things with Roberta didn't work out, the couple began courting Leah, a nurse and single mother residing in California. Leah had been brought up in a polygamous family and was also in a polygamous relationship with one of her previous partners. But when Garrick and Danielle flew to California to visit her, all parties realized that their expectations were incompatible. During a dinner date, Leah said, I work in the hospital for 8 to 12 hours. I don't feel like I should have to come home and do the laundry and cook. Obviously, Garrick liked the idea of being taken care of by another wife, whereas Danielle wanted help around the house and with her children. As Leah had no intentions of doing so, she promptly ended the courtship. Many viewers of Seeking Sister Wife are expecting, even hoping, that Garrick and Danielle split up 
as since they began practicing polygamy, at least in theory, she's become jealous and insecure despite immersing herself into her new plural marriage as best as possible. Viewers also think that Garrick doesn't care about Danielle, as he remained impassive when she broke down in tears after signing the divorce papers so that he could potentially marry Roberta. Both Garrick and Danielle have also been accused of being controlling, as Leah said that she didn't feel that she had any choice in the relationship adding. It didn't feel as genuine as I was hoping for. It was kind of really your way or the highway. There has been much speculation about the Merrifield's possible return to Seeking Sister Wife for a fifth season, but for now, nothing has been confirmed regarding definitive cast members. Thank you for spending some time with us. Make sure to like and subscribe so you never miss another video. We also handpick these videos, which we recommend you watch next. You can talk to us on all social medias or ask a question in the comments below. Thank you for being with us and we'll see you back tomorrow.